Hello and welcome to the news from Bahrain International with me, Keith Johnston. An Indian radio station targeting non-Arabic speaking expatriates will be launched in the Kingdom of Bahrain as part of national efforts to combat the novel coronavirus, COVID-19. Supreme Council for Health, the SCH President, Head of the National Task Force for Combating COVID-19, Lieutenant General Dr Sheikh Mohammed bin Abdullah Al Khalifa, hailed the cooperation of all parties to speed up the launch of the radio. He stressed the need to continue the national campaign to enhance public awareness about the official precautionary measures and instructions. He commended the planned radio, which will reach out to non-Arabic speaking residents to update them on precautionary measures and raise their awareness. Lieutenant General Dr Sheikh Mohammed bin Abdullah Al Khalifa extended thanks, particularly to the Ministry of Interior, the Ministry of Finance and National Economy and the Ministry of Information Affairs for their efforts to launch the radio station. The Ministry of Health will continue randomly selecting citizens and residents to test for the coronavirus COVID-19 as part of a comprehensive national response to the global spread of the virus. In this regard, the Information and E-Government Authority, the IGA, will select 20 individuals from each housing block on a daily basis over a duration of 12 days. Selected individuals will receive an SMS text message notifying them of the date and time of the COVID-19 test, which will take place at the drive through testing facility located at Bahrain International Exhibition and Convention Centre and should not exceed five minutes. The individuals are required to bring a valid ID for identification purposes. Through this process, the Ministry of Health aims to conduct more than 9,000 COVID-19 tests for randomly selected citizens and residents. The individuals may be accompanied by family members who will also have the option to get tested, provided that the individuals and their accompanying parties all arrive together in the same vehicle. These randomised tests, alongside other precautionary methods such as wearing a face mask in public settings, practising social distancing, washing hands and using an alcohol-based sanitizer are each designed to curb the spread of the virus. The Ministry reminds citizens and residents to adhere to health recommendations that encourage all to stay at home when possible and practice social distancing, particularly during outdoor recreation, at social obligations and at places where goods and services are bought and sold.